They're here. What's up, YouTube? Welcome, YouTube. Hello. We are playing uh, Venba today. I don't know if that's how you pronounce it. Maybe it needs a more Indian pronunciation. I don't know. I have lived in America too long. I am Indian at heart, but um, I am <laughs> I'm very Americanized. But yeah, it's a game about um, South Indian culture and, from my knowledge, cooking and stuff. And it looks really sweet. And I have a friend who is also Indian who told me that she loved it. So I'm sure I will enjoy it. Hydrate. Thank you, Zen. But I don't speak, um, I don't speak Hindi. And I think this is Tamil culture. So I don't really know. I honestly don't know enough about my own culture or like other Indian cultures. Um, it's a little loud. Give me a sec. I'm just going to turn. Oops. No, I'm going to turn this down just a little bit. That works. I think that's better. It looks better. Yeah. Um, the art's pretty. Oh, I got a mini dab. Skirt. Um, this art looks beautiful, even just based on the time you've ever seen. Yeah, it looks really nice. And I haven't seen... I don't see much Indian rep. Like, seeing Pavitra Prabhakar in um, Spider-Verse 2 was great. And it made me very happy. Think well before you dare and never ruminate once in action. Interesting. That's a good quote. I like that. I like that quote. I can still see the sheep moving in the background. <laughs> but yeah, I honestly, I want to know more about my own culture. So I like when we see media like this. I went to a Bollywood movie recently. It was Rocky or Rani Ki Pram Kahani, if any of you know what it is. It was pretty good. I liked it. Leaving already? Ayo, sorry, did I wake you? <laughs> I like the Ayo, like, knew, gave me what accent I knew I needed to have. Because <laughs> I've heard that a lot. What time is it? Eight. How are you feeling? Um, she looks nauseous. So we're going to go with nauseous. Just like yesterday. Ah. Uh, there's also that indie movie that won an Oscar for best original song last year. I haven't seen it, but everyone I've... Are you talking about RRR? Because every American I know has talked about RRR. I have not watched it yet. I know I should have, but uh, I haven't. I'm twinning with you. Yo, let's go, Zen. Hell yeah. Yeah, it is. Yeah, my parents watch RRR. They were, I kept telling them, hey, you guys should watch this movie because they watch Bollywood movies and stuff. Like, they're more in touch with their culture because they were born and raised in, like, Mumbai. Um, I was born and raised in Jersey, so. But, um, yeah, they, um, I think they liked it. And I think it has to do with kind of, like, British takeover stuff. Is it? I don't know. I don't really know the plot. I just know that everyone has told me to watch it. Like, I told my parents to watch it, and even I didn't watch it. I just heard it was good. But yeah, I should. I really want to. Anyway, moving on. <laughs> okay, I'll call your school and see you can't come in today. I was just about to leave for work. You should go back to sleep. What about your lunch? There's some leftover idli butter, uh, idli batter and garlic chutney from yesterday. Chutney is a word that I hear so many people say who aren't Indian, and it frustrates me. I don't know why, they just can't say it right. <laughs> You can see some idlis quickly. I don't know if I can figure all that out. It's okay. I was just about to leave. It's just idlis. Very easy. It'll take me too long, Venma. Don't worry. I can just survive on the coffee machine. Um, I think the most unrealistic part about this game so far is the parent being okay with the child staying home from school, even if she's sick. <laughs> I have lived it, and I know that's not how it goes. Fine, I'll make it then. Of course I'll make it. Wait five minutes. Vemba, really, it's fine. No, no, no. I need to make lunch for myself anyway. Just tell the school I'll be done in a minute. Um, The most I know is it's, it's based on Indian historical heroes, and the premise is them just being friends and doing cool, fun shit together. So, I didn't know that. I know there's one movie that's a lot like that, where it's like... A bunch of friends make like some, I think they're going through a midlife crisis or something, but they make like a pact to do a bunch of stuff that like they have a fear of. So like what, they go skydiving and stuff. I want to watch that movie. I just don't know what it is, but I know it's like a classic kind of like I've heard people talk about it. There's a lot, dude, there's a lot of Bollywood movies I want to watch. I really got it. Like the only reason I haven't watched a lot of them is because I didn't know. I guess I should have assumed, but I didn't really think about the fact that American theaters would have English subtitles. Because when I watch Bollywood movies in India, obviously there's no subtitles. I was eliminated, but I'm going for second chance in two minutes. You got this, bro! I believe in you. Ellie's doing a Rocket League uh, tournament. You haven't watched them because you're a racist. Yeah, and how many of you watched, Ellie? Hmm? Tell me. Tell me about, uh, tell me about, tell me about, um... 
I can't think of any names. There's one movie that we just call Jadu. Jadu is like the word for ghost or alien or something. Um, but it's not the actual name of the movie, and I don't know what the movie's actually called. But if you ask like any kid my age who's like from Mumbai or anything, um, they they'll know what I, what <laughs> what I mean. Okay, let's get this done fast. Although, should I try my mother's recipe for once? The way I make it leaves are never as soft as hers. And they would always cheer me up when I'm feeling sick. I should just make them her way today. Hmm. If the recipe is still readable, that is. Yo, maybe she has a dead mom too. Ellie, you can relate, finally. <laughs> Sorry. I gotta check that this isn't copyright strikeable. Is Venba okay to stream on Twitch? Um, that is uncalled for. <laughs> Does Venba have copyrighted music? Um, if they say nothing, we'll just go for it and hope that it doesn't, and hope that I don't get struck. Nothing, nothing online. So. Um, yeah. You're about to be cancelled on X? No, not on X! My favorite platform. Alright. Italy plate, towel, cooker, ingredients, water, batter. Holes to let steam through. These also have holes so batter can cook. Make sure to... Hmm, I've not made Italy with these kinds of plates before. The only difference from mine seems to be the holes on the plates. The recipe also calls for towels. I'm not sure why. But I must swear this method makes the Italy's a lot softer. Okay. The music's really pretty. I feel like it's almost definitely copyright strikeable, but we're just gonna go with it and pray, you know? So batter can cook, make sure to blank or it will leak. Okay. So steam comes through these holes and these are holes for batter to cook. Arrange plates so steam can cook batter properly. I've seen my mom actually make uh, at least, but I, no point putting a plate without batter in the cooker. My bad. Um, what? Okay. Oh, it needs water. Okay. We're gonna put water. And then we're gonna put the batter. Unless we need to mix the batter instead. Nope. Maybe if I put this in now? Nope. Maybe a towel now. No. Maybe, uh, maybe this now. <laughs> I should stack all three plates before closing the lid. Okay. Oh, maybe I need to put this in this. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do that. And then do... Maybe I need a towel now. Nope. Okay. So yeah, I've seen my- wait, hang on. Hopefully an hour, and that means I'm cooking in Rocket League. <laughs> if not, I'll watch you cook in-game. Hell yeah, dude. Weirdest part about the Twitter layout update is that the bottom bar keeps disappearing when you scroll. Dude, honestly, I've not used Twitter enough to know. I've genuinely, uh, not been interested in using it. Now, can we put this? Nope. Um, alright, well then we put that. And then we put- nope. My friend is calling me in the middle of stream. This is so unprofessional. I will text her and let her know I'm streaming. <laughs> uh, hang on. Sorry. Um, yeah. What have I tried to say the past three times and kept interrupting myself with? Um, yeah, my mom, um, has, has made Italy before, but I've never done it with her. I always want to learn, but, like, I just, I just don't. I'm just a bad kid. <laughs> Let's see how it turns out. Okay. That should be long enough. Let's remove the lid and see how it turned out. It seems about to leak through the plate holes and spill everywhere. Let's try again. Okay. It leaked through the holes. Now, now, okay. I'm still getting texted. Okay. Rejects friend on stream to pursue cloud. <laughs> oh, wait. I can't do that. I gotta... We need water and we need this last time i had the batter like this batter leaked through the tiny holes i should try something different maybe a towel would help stop the leak okay that yeah yeah yeah, yeah. you see i'm a master chef baby here we go this is so cute i wish i knew how cooking worked in real life it'd be so cool if they added at least to real life there we go that's how you do it baby but yeah, um, this is actually genuinely a good learning experience. If you've never made idlis or anything before, like, that should be long enough. I want to know how to make dosa. 
Let's remove the lid and see how it turned out. I mean, dosa doesn't seem that difficult. That I've seen my mom cook because it's one of those things that you just cook and immediately eat. You don't have to like let it settle or whatever. Like idlis, normally you make them before and then put them in a bowl and then take them after. You know, you wait for them to cool down a little bit. It looks like only the bottom plate cooked. Oops, maybe the steam from the water didn't reach the upper plates. There must be an orientation of these plates that would let the steam pass freely. Again. Okay. Dose ads, double hit, sorry. You guys know I don't like the ads, but not much I can do about that. Was I supposed to put water? Okay, it worked still, that's fine. Um, What does it want me to do exactly? Um, It wants the holes to let the steam through. I feel like, wouldn't it want what does it want <laughs> what the heck we're probably gonna fail this one again because i don't completely know if i had the plate now would the steam holes of the bottom plate actually cook the batter of the top plate may i rotate the plate to align the steam holes better oh okay i think it wants to align with the like that kind of nope it doesn't i lied sorry maybe this way sure that works that's great i don't really get how that works i i don't cook that's the thing i wish i did i wish i knew how cooking worked welcome back from the ad sorry about that guys that should be long enough let's remove the lid and see how it turned out it's done creeper hiss you didn't get me crow i'm better than that you didn't scare me. Um, I wish I understood how any of this worked. Like, I think it's a good learning experience if you want to know how to... Achievement! If you want to know how to cut, cook. But, yeah. Oh, wow, you even took the time to make our faces. I think you forgot about my beard, though. You really didn't have to do this. What else could I do? My husband can't figure out Italy's... Oh, they're married. I thought that was the daughter. <laughs> I guess she's a teacher. Vemba, I told you to go to sleep. You've been feeling sick and exhausted. You didn't have to cook. It's not a big deal if I skip lunch once. Pavlan, you're making me choose between resting and letting you starve. That's not a fair choice to me. You're not letting me starve. I know, but that's what it feels like. And even if I had let you leave... I feel like this is the response I would hear from my mom. I couldn't sleep peacefully. I'd feel too guilty. I know I shouldn't, but you know I would. Is it so hard for you to cook even on days like this? You're right, sorry. I didn't mean to make him feel bad, but also that's exactly what I would have heard. <laughs> Is it that hard for you to learn how to cook? Come on now. Um, I've returned. Welcome back, Strick. I like cooking biz. It's like doing a more complicated Lego set. That's actually fair. I um, I don't know. I've like, I can cook sometimes. I've cooked a little bit. But for some reason, my brain, I, it's also like I don't know where half the stuff is in my kitchen. Because my mom rearranges it a lot, and I don't understand her organizing method. So I, it just it gets to me. If only brown parents communicate this perfectly, IRL, right? Welcome, Meg. How are you doing? That's so real. Uh, yes, it's expensive, but we can manage it. So do you think we should go? I don't know. Let me ask the boss again if he can make me full-time. But unless the school gives you more shifts, or my boss changes his mind, it's going to be tough to stay in Canada. Oh my god, Canada? I can't wait to go there. That's crazy. Yeah, the crazy. I was crazy once. This game new. This game new. <laughs> there are other options, but I wouldn't mind going back. I'm sure I can teach again at my old job. And there's nothing really keeping us here. That would be nice. Okay, well, why don't you leave with me now? I'll walk you to the doctor's office before I go to work. Oh, no. I'm sure all I need is some sleep. You've been saying that for two days now. Come on, I'll walk you. Doctors are free here. <laughs> free here. <laughs> Alright. This game's really pretty. I like it. I like the style. I just like seeing rep. I like seeing my own rep. Like, it's not my specific culture. And, like, obviously, like I said, I'm not as cultural as other people. But there is more than what I'm used to. You know? I've also heard the music's really good in this game. So far, it's definitely um, 
adding up. Venba, are you home? What did the doctor say? So the boss didn't even consider it. Unless a miracle happens, I say we start packing. What? What's with you? You never told me what the doctor said. Well, I think you should eat first. Uh, okay. Italy's again? I completely understand so awesome to see characters that have experiences you can relate to. Yeah, it's nice. Ah! What has gotten into you today? She's smiling, so I assume she didn't get told by the guy that she got cancer or something. I'm gonna hope that the doctor doesn't say that. I hope this isn't like a sad story. So I guess this means we have a reason to stay. Oh, baby! That's what it is. <laughs> I didn't even look at the fact that there was three faces on the, uh, on the at least. Um, I was making, <laughs> I was meanwhile making a, just a comment on how I hope she isn't dying. No, it's a happy story. I mean, raising a child back home wouldn't be so bad either, but there's a chance at a very different life here. It's only going to get more expensive though, and we're barely, sca barely scraping by as it is. Bro, how'd you not see that? I was busy. <laughs> I, was, I was busy worrying for her life. We can't provide everything other parents would be able to. What if they resent us for that when they grow up? Maybe moving back to India is the best option after all. You forgot there's a child in this game? Honestly, I didn't know what there was in this game. All I know is it was about like kind of my, my culture. Kind of. A little bit. But then they could resent us for taking away this opportunity. Hmm. What do you think, Venba? Why aren't you saying anything? I don't know. It's funny to see you wor worry like this. Are you not worried? I don't know. I feel very calm for some reason. That makes one of us. Pavlan, don't you worry. I'm sure they will turn out just fine. He was in the... Amen scream? Okay, main scream. <laughs> screen. When you boot up the game. Gotcha. Um... I mean, look at the look at the little. You can see like that really tiny little uh, image there. That has like two people there. I think. How can you be so sure? It's our child. How else could they turn out? What a sweet couple. Being outshone by one's children is a universally desired form of sweet defeat. Yo, these quotes are sweet. I like them. They're so nice. There's a third person behind the Game Pass text. Oh, uh, damn. Game Pass hates children. <laughs> Confirmed. <laughs> My name is Pavlan, sir. I feel like it would probably be pronounced like Pav Pav Pavalan or something, not Pavlan. I'm just... I think that's Tamil. Yeah, it is. Yeah. That's like the culture of this game overall. Kevin. Kevin? 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 Maybe? Oh yeah, Coven. I thought I thought she was like calling out for like a white boy <laughs> or something. Um, where'd you run off to, sir? It'd be my privilege to work with you. Pardon me, sir. I don't have time to play, Coven. I have a lot of work to do. Spoilers: the child is killed by Xbox Game Pass. No, how could you, Xbox? Why? Phil Spencer, how could you do this? <laughs> um, bouncy chair and fan blown sheet. Yeah, the fans just kind of the, the sheet is just kind of hopping up and down over there. Yes, sir. I've managed to transport of hundreds of units of inventory per day. Pardon me, sir. Govin, there you are. What are you wearing? Where's your shirt? It's a cape. Take that off. Let's get you dressed. No, I like it. That job was in India, sir, but. Govin, wait there, don't run. <laughs> Govin, come back here. This has become a routine now. I hope more streamers play this. Like the BRB gonna eat pie, all such. I was have some Yo, enjoy your pie. Yes, sir. Bachelor of Science in Physics, sir. Ayo, oh, that towel is so dirty, though. Here, wear this shirt, Kana. No! But sir, you can just take me on a probation period, maybe? I'm driven, self-started, and a quick learner, sir. 
That's like exactly what I put on my resume. <laughs> I just say, yeah, I'm a quick learner. Hire me. And hopefully they would. I actually, I applied uh, for a place recently that I really want to get. So let's, yo, fingers, keep your fingers crossed, my boys. Put this on, hurry up now. But I don't want to. Speak in Tamil, Coven. I can't even understand what you're saying. You don't have to pay until then. Please, Kana. I understand, sir. Do you see how the, the eyes of the mask fall? The KDI, yeah, I did. I did. Yes, good boy. Okay. Thank you, sir. Yes, sir. Thank you. Thank you for considering me. Good day. Praying that you get it. I'm not religious, so I don't know who I'm praying to, though. <laughs> Hello, Mr. Bachelor Science. What happened? Same old. <laughs> they didn't buy the hundreds of... I'm telling you it's time for it to go. I'm gonna go with that. That seems nicer. What? My beard? This is a phone interview. Your clean shave theory doesn't hold water here. I spend half these calls asking them to, them to repeat themselves. I should watch cartoons with Coven. If I understand those shows, maybe I understand these peoples too. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> we can watch Batman together, Appa. Yes, but your son is going to forget Tamil, Tamil at this rate. Did you know his friends call him Kevin? See? See? I... What's wrong with that? Speak in Tamil, though. Well, what's wrong with that? It's only one letter that's different anyways. Names tell stories. I feel like I would hear that from people. Like, probably not my parents, but like my aunt and uncle. Fingers crossed you get the job. Gonna go eat dinner. I should be back. Yo, enjoy your dinner, Meg. I hope I get that job, dude. I really want it. It would be fun. I'd, like to, I'd probably see a lot of kids that I know because it's like, it's a boba place. So, you know, but that would be funnier though. Like that'd be awesome. I could like piss in their drink. I wouldn't do that if <laughs> my employer's watching. <laughs> um, I'm normal. It's a way for people to learn about you and where you're from. You shouldn't be afraid to correct your friends. It's your name after all. Who else is going to tell them? And Coven means beautiful. It's such a lovely name and it suits you so well. Okay. I don't want to be beautiful. I just want to be Kevin. He's brighter than us, man, but he's learned to adapt. We haven't. You know, he asked yesterday's English quiz. He did? Really? Good job. We should celebrate that kind of. That, I don't know what. I, there's certain words that, like, I know how you would say them, maybe, but I, I feel awkward saying them because I'm, like, switching between. Um, and like my American accent, my Indian accent, it's difficult, man. You'd piss in their drink in a video game. In a video game, yeah, Mason. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Meg was texting me. Sorry, Meg's Meg's wanted to watch and she just didn't make an account ever, but she made a Twitch account now so she could show up and chat. But yeah, she's one of my friends. What do you want to eat? I'll make something special. Oh, can we order pizza? Dude, that's so real. That's so me as a kid. Again, like, Govan is essentially me and my sister. Because we were, like, the first kids in, like, America. I mean, they're in Canada, but, you know, like, in a Western country. So, it's it's so real. Like, I, I'm always asking for, like, pizza and stuff instead of Italy or Dosa. I want pizza. Uh, how about we make something at home? Uh, you should play ending games more often because this is way better than your British accent. Yeah, cuz I didn't grow up with a British accent But I don't I don't know many Indian games. Honestly, it's kind of frustrating That's why I was happy when I heard about this one. I was like very quick to be like, all right, we're gonna play this um, That sounds so much better than a hot warehouse with no AC. Oh my god. Yeah, the boba place is much nicer Also, I'm realizing I'm getting so sidetracked like if you are watching this in hopes that I'll do a quick 100% playthrough, it's not happening. Uh, welcome back, Ellie. <laughs> he was back quick. Jesus, dude. That was like less than 20 minutes. Oh, God. Man, how would you play Rocket League for like three, 400 years and still suck? <laughs> no, no. It's a 100% playthrough. It's just a quick 100% playthrough. <laughs> or not a quick 100% playthrough. It's going to take a couple hours. Cause I'm fucking around a lot. Like Prota? Is that how you spend uh, is that how you spell that? I thought it was P-A-R-A-T-H-A. P-A-R-A-T-H-A. Yeah. 
Perota, Perot. Here's another thing. I um second guess my um my pronunciations a lot because I was I'm was born in America. Yeah, it's a slow run. It's it's a snail run, not a speed run. I was born in America, raised here. So like my um. Well, actually, when I searched it up, it showed Perota like that. But yeah, my just my pronunciation stuff, I always second guess. So I might be a little stuttery in this in this stream, a little more than normal. I want to stream Fall Guys, but to be honest, you saved me from it. Because <laughs> I don't want to anymore. That video, high quality. What video is this? Why did my mod put a video in chat? Oh. <laughs> it's one of my TikToks about why I should be a voice actor. <laughs> anyway. Dosa? Idiom, idiopum? I actually don't know what that is. Gidosa? Gidosa, sorry. Gidosa? My grandma has that. Didn't want to like steal your viewers or whatever you see complain about. I literally don't complain about that. I don't care if you stream. Go stream. Go stream right now. I don't care if you don't want to. Go do it right now. Go. Go for it. Bye. <laughs> wow, Ellie. Oh, I'm sorry to hear your grandma has Gidosa. Uh, biryani, yeah, I don't eat it, but my parents do sometimes. Cutty dosa, man, he's just, he's only suggesting dosa, that's great. No, I'm tired of all of these. I said I want pizza, extra cheese, extra toppings. You eat pizza all the time. Coven, have you ever had puta? Putu? Put, not puta, <laughs> that's just a bitch in Spanish, my bad. <laughs> I'm so used to saying that, I didn't know what the word was saying. <laughs> no, what's that? I've only seen my mother make it before. It's a lot of fun to make. Reminds me of a rocket. Opinion on pizza with ketchup. Here's the thing. Indian people have like everything with ketchup. I've had mac and cheese. I was I grew up being told that mac and cheese with ketchup is normal. Um, and it's good. And yeah. So I would say probably pizza with ketchup would taste good. I mean, you already have the pizza sauce. You just have a little more sauce. You know? Rocket. Yeah, so a lot of steam comes out when you make it. It looks just like a rocket launching. It does? Yes. But you know what? Let's just order pizza. There's no rocket, but you get a nice cardboard box. That is such an that's such an Indian mom thing to do. <laughs> just like reverse psychology you. <laughs> that's so real. Mac and cheese with ketchup is pretty good. It is, I'm telling you, it is. Zen doesn't like it, but it is. Will it really look like a rocket launch? I've had it. It's pretty good, but it doesn't usually go well with any pizza toppings other than cheese. Yeah, that's fair. If I had anything else, I would definitely not want ketchup. Like, onion and ketchup or mushroom and ketchup sounds disgusting. Do you want to see? I fixed my name and it showed up. It did! Welcome! Soot Crow. New friend. N nice to meet you, uh, Soot Crow. We actually knew someone in the past who was named Crow, but um, I think they're gone now. It's over for them. But nice to meet you. <laughs> All right, let's get started. I haven't made this before, but Amma has a recipe on it. Hopefully, it's readable. Where's the rocket? We need to make the flower first. <laughs> Hi, I'm new. I'm new. Crazy how fast you sub to me, Soot Crow. <laughs> uh, my brother ate apples and mustard when he was younger, and I used to eat jelly and cheese. Okay, maybe Zen doesn't need to talk. How do, can we have a <laughs> can we have a poll on whether Zen is allowed to talk or not? <laughs> Uh, ingredients 500g rice water blend 500g rice separate fine rice from chunks something <laughs> thanks all right let's make some fire i keep clicking to try to scrub away the problem but um then it just goes into the next part anyway when do we get to the rocket part soon uh, be, be patient oh and then com combine them so we're gonna put this in here we're gonna blend it up Then we're gonna s separate. I should shake this sieve over the tower to catch up, catch everything. Oh, look at that! Okay, cool. Why these people look like you? By the way, could they be from South India? Maybe. Yeah, maybe something like that. <laughs> Did Zen make the poll? Should Zen have opinions on food? And there's a lot of people voting yes. Like a hundred times more than are in the chat. <laughs> oh, that's so funny. 
<laughs> Send Zen to Brazil. Yo, Brazil shout out. Let's go. I voted many, many times. Um, I don't know what this says exactly. Hmm. Let's combine the fine rice with water and just go for it, right? Wait, wait, hang on. Wouldn't the fine rice be... Wait, <laughs> wait, okay. Recipe says adding flour to the rice is a final step. Do you think this is right? Hmm, no. This is way too runny. We must have added less than 500 grams of rice. We need to find a way to use all of it. Okay. Alright, so we gotta use our brain. So this is soaked rice, which is what they want, right? Yeah, so we need to blend the rice. Let's try that again. That third step is where I'm messing up, so let's do this. I spent 2,000 points on that? Jesus, dude. Um... Hmm. Oh! I know what we should do. We probably do this, and then sieve it. And we get the fine rice, and then we put this back in there, and we do it again, right? Hydrate, thank you, I'll do that in just a sec. Or I'll just do it now, actually. All right, and then we can do it again. And then we, we just keep going. We just gotta use all of it. You're so smart. Ari, I know I'm such a smart little, I'm so, I'm so, I'm so smart guys. Look at how good I am at my job. There we go. We've used all of it. And now we dunk that in the water. I think this is perfect. Why does this feel like flour even though there was so much water? We have to mix the water and flour little by little. The final consistency should feel like slightly wet sand. Is that like cocaine LMAO drugs? <laughs> Thanks, dude. I'm still saving up towards no cursing. So Jazz has had no cursing for so long and hasn't used it yet. So, you know. So, 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 fu so, fu get fucked, get fucked, get fucked. That's what I have to say. <laughs> All right, that wasn't too hard. Amma, when will we get to the rocket? This kid wants one thing out of life. And honestly, I can't blame him. Uh, why is every cookie, <laughs> every single, um, page is messed up? This is such a dog shit book. This is from her mom. It's not even like generations old. It's from her mom. Don't say the shit word, Ari. The shit word is an inappropriate word. My bad. I, I will try not to say the shit word. Yeah. <laughs> um. Okay. Flour, coconut, four tablespoons of a tablespoon of blah and three of blah and then water. Um, put coconut layers as far from away from each other as possible. So, Ari never swears on stream. No, I would never. I would never. Um, okay, this is straightforward. Assemble the parts so that water steams and cooks what's above. Tricky part is figuring out how much rice and coconut is needed. And in what order? Coconut can crumble easily. Okay. So it's gonna ste it's gonna do whatever's at the top. So sh surely flowers at the top, right? Well, we can put water at the bottom, like there. And then in here, who's dong? Did I say something about a dong? I don't I don't remember what I said. I forgot what I said. <laughs> um. Let's put three tablespoons of flour. Wait, that's coconut flour. Oh, and this is flour. Let's put three tablespoons of flour. Oh, wait, it wants three. I assume. There we go. One, two, three. Put coconut layers as far away from- Oh! Oops, I already messed it up. Wait, can I? Oh, I can. Okay, cool. I reset. There we go. We're gonna put one of these. 
No, wait, I can't. Because if I want four layers... Oh, no, because I probably need four layers of flowers. So we're going to put one, and then 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 one of these. And that should be that. And then I attach this to something. To the top, right. Of course. And I turn, then I turn this on. It's launch time, Coven. Coven. <laughs> Coconuts to be far away from each other. Yeah, I made it work. I think I didn't make it work. I did it wrong. I d I'm bad at this LED maker and tree 2400 channel points Jesus. Oh my gosh Launch a crumbling putu. my bad. I Really don't know what this even is. I haven't made this food before so I haven't eaten it before I think it's coconut and the two flowers and repeat. Well, that's not how that's not the flower we're talking about But yeah, hmm Venmo, I think coconut layers make it crumble. Yes, the book says to keep the coconut layers as far apart as possible. The only way I see that working is if we put the coconut in first. Okay. Oh, yes. So we got to do it the other way. The opposite of what I did. I think. Oh, I'm sorry. One more. One more. And then we do that. And then we do that. It's launch time, Kevin. And success. Nope. <laughs> Ari wants to be Walter. Walter. So bad. Yeah, I do. We'll get it this time. Coconut layers should be as far away from each other as possible, right? The only thing I see is we see. I think that only means we should only. Oh. <laughs> Fucking idiot. One, two, one. One, two, one. Guys, here's the thing, right? Like, here's the thing. It's Puzzle games are hard when you are, like, streaming, too. You don't understand, okay? I, I'm i not an idiot. I'm not a fucking idiot. What's the, what's the thing that he says in, in, um, I think you should leave? I'm not a fucking idiot. Wait, I want to, I'm not a stupid fucking idiot. I know comedy. <laughs> I, dude, I love, I gotta watch that show. It's such a, it's, I'm not a stupid fucking idiot. <laughs> anyway, if no one gets that reference, just pretend you didn't hear it. It's fine. <laughs> you can't demote me in my own chat. I made it work. Look, see, see, see what I did. Isn't that amazing? Wow, that was so cool. Then, but I can't believe it didn't fall. I'm, uh, can we do that again? Successfully launched. There we go. Burger King foot lettuce. We're unable to offer you our secondary teacher position at this time. However, we encourage you to apply again next year. Oh, no. Have you seen the Barbie movie yet? Loved it. Yeah. Um, <laughs> Ellie demoted me when? Zen is like my best friend ever more than Ari. Hey. Hey. Is Zen coming to see you in Canada? No. That's what I thought. Pussy boy. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> so unnecessarily harsh. Did you wear pink for the Barbie movie? Dude, we all, like, me and my family bought Barbie shirts just for the Barbie movie. They were, like, 27 bucks, and then we returned them. Because, come on. 27 bucks? Are you kidding me? I'm never wearing that shirt again. Um. Um. If you truly were my best friend, you wouldn't come visit me, and you'd leave me alone. All right, then I'm not your best friend. Is he asleep? I think so. Kevin? Yes, he is. Good. So that interview. Another dead end? Yes. I think I knew that before I took the call. No relevant Canadian ex work experience. We'll keep you on file. I don't know. I feel like I deluded us into thinking we can make it work here. Well, don't worry. I'll go to the employment office again tomorrow. What? I know you don't like Suresh. But I think you should take that sales job at his company. It's all about who you know here. That's true. Talking about this right next to your sleeping son. Yeah, but he's asleep. They, they don't have time to talk about when he's awake. Zen sent me a clay frog with headphones. You never did that for me. Listen, man. I, I, I'm not an artist. I try to be, but I'm bad at it. 
I tried to make you a birthday present once, even though I know you hate your birthday, but it was just a nice little sweet present. Uh, but my artist friends ended up making it look nicer, you know? <laughs> when, he, when he's awake, all they do is cook good. That's their day. And we barely know anyone. We're not in a position to pick and, pick and choose our help. I thought moving here would be a chance to start over. That even here we st still have to beg people like Suresh. It's not begging. I know. I'll call him tomorrow. Thank you. But honestly, I think you're more qualified for sales than I am. I mean, the way you sold Coven on the puta, put, puta, on the puta today. <laughs> you're really good with kids. I can't believe you're having a hard time teaching in school. Well, it's not like teaching back home. It makes me worry about Coven. I can teach you anatomy, Ari. I'm good. I just, I'm... I I want to I want to draw in my own funky little wolf little flavors. I don't I don't give a shit about anatomy anymore. All my characters are going to be they're going to look like shit and that's going to be my art style from now on. Cuz I don't care anymore. I just want to enjoy drawing, which means they can be little pieces of shit. They can be little funky little guys. I don't care. <laughs> Why? Well, back home I could get the class to laugh, open up, get them in the mood to learn. But it's harder here. What does that have to do with Kavdin? I just feel that there's a wall between me and the class. That is so true. That is something I have experienced. Like, Indian teachers struggle. Like, pe people are not receptive to Indian people in this country. And if you think that that's just me, like, victimizing myself or whatever, like, personally, I'm fine. People really can't tell I'm Indian mostly. And, like, my I don't have an accent. But if you have an accent, like, you're going to deal with some pretty bad shit. So... That, it's not it's not great um Ari since Ellie replaced you who's replacing Ellie as your best friend no one no one can replace Ellie in my heart he may not need me but I need him just as much as ever I just feel that there's a wall between me and my class I can't connect with them they lead very different lives than me did I feel that same wall growing around Coven how do you mean what if I can't connect with Coven I was never Ari's best friend it was always with Scrub uh Ari agree or Scrub's gonna have yeah, yeah, it was scrub. It was scrub. It was scrub. It scrub was my Ellie. I was never my best friend. It was scrub. It's so hard to even talk to him. It just feels like he's going further away from us. It's so hard to even talk to him. I think that's fair. That's that's a problem that my parents had too. Uh, my sister would actually speak uh, Hindi all the time or Gujarati. Sorry, she would speak Gujarati all the time with my family, and then she didn't know English when she went to uh, preschool. So then they taught her English and then she only started speaking English. And then when I was born, she would only speak English to me, which is why my Gujarati is so much worse because I never really spoke it growing up. I, mean, I was pretty good at it, but like by the time she had started um, going to school and stuff, she was starting to teach me English. So it's an interesting thing being uh, ch children of immigrants or like first or second generation, you know? This is such a tragic relationship. This feels like the end of succession, guys. This feels like the red wedding at Game of Thrones. I've been watching a lot of dramas. <laughs> the Indian teachers on YouTube always have my full and undivided attention. Yeah, that's true. The Indian teachers on YouTube get a lot of respect, but like Indian people in general really don't, really don't. I don't know why, it sucks. Um. Anyway, he talks so fast. They get mad at me too, because I talk fast in, in English. A lot of my family doesn't know what the hell I'm talking about. It's hard to understand him. It's like he's in a different world than us. What's well, more than just that? Uh, he doesn't eat lunch at school. He's not interested in anything we do. I don't know why the food would be an issue. I thought I could at least get him to listen to music or watch some movies from back home, but he'd rather watch Home Alone for the hundredth time. I don't know, I'm worried. These things bother me too, but we chose to bring him up here, not him. We did it because we thought he'd have a better life here. And he does. This place comes with better education and op opportunities. Second gen kids sun galls. Yeah, dude, that's what I'm saying, bro. <laughs> I just saw that. That's so funny. But it also comes with his own culture, language, values. We can't pick and choose the ones we want and ask him to ignore from the others. I think it's natural that any kid wants to fit in, right? Yes, maybe. It's just scary. Don't worry, Vimba. He'll turn out just fine. How are you so sure? He's our child. How else will he turn out? <laughs> oh, 
Oh, sunglasses is a Discord emo. I think you just <laughs> miswrote sunglasses. I thought that was very funny. Homelone is goaded. I didn't read it. Those fallen from their resolve are stripped of respect. No! I didn't read it! No! <laughs> oh, that's sad. I should stop getting distracted. There's a difference between searching out help for technical issues online and actually holding a teaching position. Yeah, like even there are Indian teachers online who teach math, English, stuff like that, and they do it really well. Um, but like in person, it's a whole different story. I don't know. You know how normally people are shittier online because you don't have to look them in the face? Somehow people are shittier in person a lot of the time when it comes to Indian people uh, that I've noticed um, just from watching. It's it's crazy. Anyway. Hey, that's Big Boss font, the font I use for my branding. Shout out! <laughs> Shout out to LEV Maker. Not Indian. Go on, tell her. His name is Babylon. But ba yeah, I'm going to say it like that because I don't know what the proper pronunciation would be. He's my dad. P A A V A L A N. She says Appa is not at the office. Does she know what time he left? Do you know when my dad left the office? Oh, oh wait, that's so cool. I just noticed that they make the uh, the text like kind of goopy whenever he speaks English because it's harder for Venba to understand. But you're Indian and he's your dad. You should know, my bad. I was raised English. I was raised speaking English and with an English accent. So yeah. And you know, to me, his name is dad. You know what I mean? <laughs> People are shittier online because you have to look them in the eye. <laughs> Did I say that? I don't think I said that. Anyway, okay, well, does she at least know if he came in today? Do you see my dad today? Ask her if he usually leaves with anybody. Maybe we can call them? Does he usually go home with someone? I think he did. Oh, well, shit. <laughs> she says no, dad usually leaves alone and he's very quiet. She says all the sales staff left at 5 p.m. today. She says he must have left then too. Okay, thank you. I'm going to believe that I didn't say anything wrong. I've never said anything wrong in my life. Everything I've said, I've said for a reason, you know? Why did they give her no, like... Why are we walking through the park, Amma? Do you think Appa will be here? Why did they give her, like, no body? She She's... Bro, bro, <laughs> you know women are allowed to have, like, skin, right? <laughs> Jesus. I don't know, Ganna. Sometimes your Appa loves to walk instead of taking the bus. If you decide to walk home from the office, it should be through here. But the lady said Appa left at 5. What's taking him so long? She's a walking stick? Yeah. Do you think he went somewhere else first? But where did he go for this long? I don't know, Gavin. Enough with your questions. Stylistic choice that could work too, but you know, I just think it's Interesting <laughs> when they draw women like that <laughs> Sorry, no, I'm just worried about Appa. Why are you so worried? Do you think something happened to him? No, no, I'm sure he's fine You don't have to stay quiet coven here. You can ask me anything you want See that's unrealistic. My parents would never do that <laughs> They'd be like yo shut the fuck up. <laughs> what are you what are you talking about? I'm trying to figure this out Anything? Yes, and I'll answer it. But only if you can ask it in Tamil. Okay? Oh, okay. I can do that. Mm -mm. Okay? Okay. I can do that. Why did that lady say that Appa is very quiet? He talks a lot at home. Oh, look at you go. See, you can speak Tamil when you want to. Hmm. I don't know. Maybe it's just that... Maybe it's that they don't talk to him. What do you mean? Ah, uh, nothing. He doesn't really like his job coming. That's why. He was a writer back home, right? Did he like his job then? All the characters kind of lanky, but her vase, waist is very small. Yeah. Oh, yes. He loved to write. How come I never see him write at home? Well, he always writes when something bothers him. Back home, that used to be every day. Maybe you should bug him more. <laughs> the kids... <laughs> um, The kid is actually still speaking English. This game is uh, really stupid. <laughs> um, What did you do back home? <laughs> Literally unplayable. Same as here. I was a teacher. 
And not just a supply teacher, I taught math for 9 to 12 standard, standards. <laughs> I taught math for 9 to 12th standard. Were you a cool teacher? What's a cool teacher? Fun and easy going. Like, were the kids scared of you? Only kids named Coven. I don't know, I like to think I was good at it. My classes were always fun for the students. Though I don't think I'm a cool teacher here. I miss those days. But you teach here too. It's not the same. Why not? I don't know. It's just not. This is whitewashing culture. <laughs> yeah, you can only play this game if you know Tamil. Uh, why'd you move here? Do you think you'll ever go back? Um, why'd you move here? It wasn't an easy choice. Babylon wanted to be with me. And I couldn't imagine being with anyone else. But a lot of people took issue with us being together, and they decided to make it our problem. It was getting really hard to deal with, so we gambled on a fresh start here and took it. This is a real thing that I'm sure a lot of Indians would relate to, honestly. I want to do art. I also need to send a lot of art I forgot to send. Yeah, do it! Yeah, see, Ellie's right. You keep, What's stopping you? Amma, I see Appa. I swear to God if he's dead in a ditch somewhere. I swear to God. She looks worried. Or if he's if he's cheating on her. Yo. This I can't deal with this right now. Come on. She always looks sad because I think she is sad because I think she sees him and there's a problem. Camera pants him on the ground in the family dead pose. That's what I was thinking. I was like. Yeah. Oh no. Oh, he probably got beat up. Oh no. Okay, he's okay. At least. He's smoking. Oh no. At least he's alive. At least he's alive. Oh no. Poor Coven had to see that, bro. Oh no. He secretly Batman and the secret is out. Yeah, I'm sure that's what happened. I think <laughs> this is universe 617 where Batman is Indian. Complete the park level. Nothing, no matter how dear, should be sought at the expense of one's honor. Stannis Baratheon could take a word or two from that quote. Game of Thrones reference, baby. If you haven't watched it, you won't get it. You should have watched it, idiot. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, okay, I just finished cutting up the onions too. I think you should have everything you need. Yes, thanks, Pa. I'll go help Coven back. It pans over to him and he's twitch streaming. Worst ending. You heard it here first. Ellie only cares about the money. Money, money. What are we making? Biryani. It's okay, cool. Yeah, yeah. No, this page is great. This recipe is completely unreadable. Larry biryani is really fancy. I've never made it that way before. But I've seen Amma make it the night before we left India. Maybe I can try remembering them. Remember, add all these first. These ingredients. So expensive. Amma, why are you going through all this trouble? It's okay, Di. It's a big thing to leave to another country. I don't know when I'll be able to cook for you again. There's a logic to the order you add these four ingredients in. You want all of them to fry in the oil nicely, but the ingredient you add first will always fry more in the oil than the one you add next. Right, so if I want onions to turn golden brown, they need to be fried the most. And remember, once you add tomatoes to release so much water, it's hard for anything to fry after. So onion first, then uh, the other two, and then tomato. Now the beef goes in after we add all the salt and powders. That order is important. After we add all the sal salt and powders. Then add water and let it reduce. Ah, uh, how am I going to remember all this? Don't worry, I've added all these instructions to the recipe book I gave you. Yeah, and she took really good care of it. Uh, I think they said add this first <laughs> money subscribe and like let's go <laughs> 
I finally sent some art. Let's go. Time to finally make myself a Twitch banner. I totally forgot my, um, uh, Risco made a, a, tw a new Twitch banner for me. Well, they made a, 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 a flag for me. Um, and then I was like, can I use this as a Twitch banner? And I should really go and set that up because it's really pretty. Anyway, moving on. Um... What did we need at first? Was it the fennel seeds or what? I think it was all of it, right? It was like the fennel seeds. It was the... It was this. Okay. We're gonna add this. Add this. Add this. And I think also add this. Uh, I can never get tired of how great toasted whole sm spices smell. Um, I wish you'd see how much these cost here. You would lose your mind over these prices. Okay. So you have those. Um, now we need... Wait, I want to just check something. After all the salts and powders. Okay. Hydrate. Thank you. Appreciate it. I didn't mean to press Y again. <laughs> Donkey Shrek reference. Okay. Um. Okay. Um. Well, we need to put the onion first. And then we'll put the chilies and maybe the paste. And the tomatoes. Of course the tomatoes go in last. You went through a lot of trouble for the recipe book, Amma. I'm sorry I couldn't take better care of it. Yeah, you really didn't. But I'm fixing these now and I hope Govan can appreciate it when he cooks these. If he ever does. Now we need to put all the... Uh, I think we put all the spices. Turmeric, obviously. Biryani masala. Salt. Then we put the beef. And then we put the water. And then we let it reduce. This smells divine. I think we need to... We just need to let it simmer for 3 minutes and we can start the layering. See Shrek, I can't hate on you because of all people who are like, we like Ari more than Ar Ellie. You're the only one who actually shows up to their streams. <laughs> right? Yeah. Shrek is a real one. Crow too, I think. Sometimes. Crow shows up sometimes, but Crow is like always there in VC when I show up. Gravy is done. All that's left is the biryani. I hope I can finish it before Coven leaves. She looks tired. I did it right first try, baby. That's how you do it. That's how we do it. Um, okay. One, two, three, one stun. Let's let sit in low flame for 30 minutes. Okay, we need one, two, one, two, three. Okay. One, two, one, two, three. At least the second part is salvageable. I think the idea is to put everything in the pot it's pot so Seal tightly and let it simmer together. The one, two, three might refer to the different layers of gravy rice and other things, but in what order? Maybe I can try to remember. Wait, one thing I want to see. What is it again? Okay, let's sit on low flame for 30 minutes. I see. We just add all these together on top of the rice layer. And that's the final layer? Yes. What's wrong, Amma? Oh, Amma, why are you crying? You know we'll visit often, and when things, once things are better, we'll come back here. This is our home. Where else will we go? I know, I know it's just so far away. Damn! She gave it- she gave the recipe book to this woman, like, right before she left for Canada and the recipe book got this ruined. She was not taking good care of it at all. Um, yeah, but Crow wasn't in my chat at that time when that happened. Fair enough. You're right. It's happened before, but, you know. But, yeah. Okay. I- sorry, I didn't even see what- what was the last- So this is the last, uh, layer, whatever that is. Um. Anyway, <laughs> oh wait, do I put it in here, or are we putting it in here? Yeah, I assume we put it in here. So they said that rice is the the bottom layer. So it's one, two, one, two, three. So rice, I assume, goes in here. Rice. Let's restart. <laughs> I already messed it up. I feel like. What? What am I? Um, I feel like the key would be the middle one, maybe. Oops, I didn't mean to do that. I No, I don't want hints. Don't want hints. You just add all these together on top of the rice layer. And that's the final layer. Okay. Okay. 
this is basically overcooked x a little to the left and add lore to it right and we're actually playing a little to the left later so um all right let's add rice let's just go with it right let's just go with it let's do let's do rice let's do some let's do ghee right maybe and like some saffron milk right and then and then another rice and then and then we're gonna do everything else you know what i mean <laughs> i don't think this is the right sequence okay fine Oh, interesting. So I can take out a little bit. Then <laughs> this boys is how you make the power puff girls. You're welcome. They said you put it all on top of rice. Oh, hang on. Hmm. So maybe this is the bottom layer too. Um but it's one, two, one, two, three. So what, what would two be? Like say one is this. Cause what I think it's saying. Oh, I understand now. Give me a sec. We do that. Then we do this. Then we do that. And then we put all of this on top. I think this is right. I just have to cover it with the lid now. There we go, baby. Just need to keep the flame very low and let it all cook together. The rice will fully absorb all the moisture from the gravy. <laughs> from the gravy, deeply flavoring it. I can't wait. There we go. Yeah. Sugar, spice, and everything rice. And chemical X. Got it? Got it? Get it? <laughs> it's like, it's like, the anyway, should be good now. God, I love how my humor is just going, get it? And then moving on. <laughs> Looks amazing. That wasn't 30 minutes, guys. I think we didn't leave it for long enough. Achievement. Family beef. We gonna are we gonna talk about this man's abuse? About the fact that the man just got abused? We gonna have any conversations about that at all? Yo, he got older. How did he get so much older and his glasses are still broken? Dog, what the hell? <laughs> what? <laughs> I, he just didn't bother getting new glasses for the past like 10 years. Jesus. She's also getting much older. Do you see her graying hair? Cheap parents for you? Fair. Glasses are expensive? Yeah, I guess. I guess, but like... Uh, why is he looking more like you little by little? That feels racially motivated. <laughs> How is it? Oh, so good. Beef really is the best. <laughs> Oh, it's really good. I'm, I'm glad. I won't get many chances to cook for you like this again. <laughs> she's getting old and she's getting kind of, she's kind of getting more and more attractive. Or is it just me? Do you think that she's a milf <laughs> or is it just me? Dude, I'm going to be honest. Like, I think Ellie needs therapy. Maybe when I go to Canada, it's just me and Daisy grabbing him one arm each and dragging him to therapy. Um, anyway. Um, stop being so dramatic. I'm just moving. I'm moving out for university. Yeah, it's gonna, but we'll miss you. Have you packed everything? It's a long drive. We may have to get gas on the way. Oh, as it turns out, my friends are driving there today after all. So I'll be going with them. Oh. This way you and Uppa won't have to drive all day. This is a real conversation I've had. <laughs> where they wanted to drive me and I was like, no, 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 I, I got it. We're good. We're, I'm, I'm good. And they're like, no, 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 but we can, we can take you. It's. <laughs> he has glasses and a hoodie what's the difference and he's brown yes we're exactly the same honestly <laughs> be attracted to older women boldly no balls she's so beautiful she is the thing is ellie's into like anyone who is a mother like if they have a child and they're a woman he's turned on <laughs> that goofy graduation pic dude mine was way worse i hate my graduation picture it's so bad um we want to see the university i was looking forward to the drive we want to see the university. I thought it'd be nice to see all the classrooms and buildings. You can give us a tour. It's not a hassle at all for us to drive you. We'd love to. It's just more convenient. There's nothing to tour, really. Just a bunch of gray buildings. Okay, Kana, sure. Did I even get any of the meat pieces? Uh, maybe we can drive there next week. Drop, drop off some food. Oh, I almost forgot. Will your friend's car have enough space for some containers? I don't know why. I've packed a lot more of the biryani. I also packed some buddies, pickles, and sweets. 
Did she give all the pieces to Coven? <laughs> He's just thinking that. Did she give all the pieces to Coven? <laughs> That's so real. That's so me. I actually have a type, and I think my type is this lady or your sister. Yo, fuck off. <laughs> fuck you. Oh my god. All these people do is like cook, eat, and get beat up. Yo, dude. Uh, people these days, all they do is cook and eat and get beat up. Um, I can't take that in the car. Why not? I've packed for your friends too. You can all eat. Um, they don't want biryani. And the whole car will smell. I don't want them in my dorm either. You don't want any of it? Coven, I put a lot of effort into making all of it this week. I didn't ask you to. Why are you getting mad? I know you didn't ask. But what will you even eat there? I don't know. There are cafeterias, instant noodles, whatever. I'll figure it out. I can't believe she gave him all the pieces. <laughs> I'm just eating this guy here. <laughs> That's so funny. That's not healthy, Coven. You can't eat out every day. Literally everyone there will be doing that. I'm just trying to be helpful. Well, you're not. Why don't you just take some of it? You don't have to eat it. I said no, I'm, uh, I'm done with this. This is a fresh start for me. I don't want to smell like little India anymore. I just want to be normal for once. Tiki's mom is a different thing. It's not about looks. She's the one. Okay, screenshotting that real quick. Real quick. Just mm -mm. screenshot. Okay. Um, yeah. If anyone, uh, if anyone, hang on. <laughs> the next time Cheeky talks to me, I will be DMing him that to him. <laughs> Did he say he, I don't want to smell like a little Indian? No, he doesn't want to smell like little India. It's just a term of like, Indian food generally is like, people say it's like smelly or whatever. And there's like a pretty bad stigma around it. I've dealt with it before. That's why I, even I hated hated bringing Indian food to like campus or whatever or to school. It's <sighs> it's bad. Um, so I relate to this story. This is this is a good story. I like it so far. Kanna, the language you speak, the food you eat, the clothes you wear, only you should decide that, Kevin. You don't have to change who you are for us, but just be sure you're not changing who you are for anyone else either. There's a wonderful and beautiful culture that's a part of you. It'd be a shame if you chose not to be a part of it, just because you think it's not normal. Then why did we even move here? We should have just stayed in India. Je <laughs> Zed, you're my best friend ever. You can't betray me, snitch. <laughs> I'm surrounded by snitches. All food smells, what's the difference? Yeah, it just smells strong. That's the thing. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to yell. It's just, there's no need to create a fuss over any of this. It's not like you're never going to see me again. I'll visit often, okay? Okay. I'll call every week too, just so please try not to worry. Okay? All right. This game's gonna make me cry. I can feel it. Is that them? Yes, I think so. Who's that girl? I've never seen her before. Smart kid. This is why he didn't want us to drive him. Chip off the old block. <laughs> God. There he goes. I suppose it's good that he's so independent and makes his own choices. Even if they are so incorrect. <laughs> Damn, got him. Our choices were mostly made for us already. Whatever he chooses, at least will be his own decision. We just have to wait patiently for him to come back to us. Until then, it's just the two of us again, huh? Just like old times. Aww. We're unable to offer you our secondary position at this time. Again? Oh, gosh. Ellie, <laughs> stop being mean to my chat. Actually, that's my mod. You can be as mean as you want. My mods are mean to me anyway. They have too much power on this chat. <laughs> I'm going to drink some water. I'm so nice to you, Ari. Yeah, when you're around. Yeah. <laughs> when I'm here, yeah, you knew. You knew. Um. <laughs> oh, did Coven reach, reach the university? Did he text or call yet? No. But we told him to text or call when he gets there, right? Yes. Well, maybe he hasn't got... He, oh, he has. I kept waiting and got worried, so I finally called him. Um. Well, rip Ellie. Damn, L. L, Ellie. <laughs> he just said he forgot to enforce and hurried to hang up. 
Ah, uh, well, it's a big day after all. Oh, I also do that, by the way. Whenever I went to campus, I would forget to text and be like, hey, I'm at campus. It's so real. So real. Uh, I'm sure there's a lot going on there. Oh, sure. Let your son do as he likes. I'm not going to bother anymore. He doesn't want to eat what we make. He doesn't want to speak in Tamil. He doesn't even want the game we name we gave him, not the game we named him. I'm done chasing after him. Yes, you're right. Oh, wait. He threw out his headphones in his room. I was going to bring it to him sometime next week. But maybe we should just let him pick it up whenever he's here next. Oh, he did? Of course not, Pavilon. We should help if we can. <laughs> he uses his headphones all the time. It'll be hard for him without that. What? Oh, you made that up. Is there anything more fleeting than your anger towards Govan? That's what being a parent is, I suppose. Hey, Carousel. What's up? Spelled my name wrong, but all right. <laughs> Welcome to chat. Um, Zen is my mobile g game notification. Yeah, that's so real. Or so yeah, noted notification. I, I so as you guys know, I've been trying to finish the a little to the left achievements, and one of the achievements requires me to log in every day for like thirty days, and um. Uh, today Zen reminded me, hey, do today's uh, puzzle, and I did it, and then I said. Thanks, mobile noti notification. And then I laughed at the fact that I said titication because instead of notification, and it was funny. Anyway, moving on. <laughs> the story's not funny. We have to end with it. It was funny. Um, when Coven said he wants to pursue writing, I was so happy. Finally, something we have in common. I wanted to show him all the works that inspired me and all the poems and stories that I love. And the ones you wrote, too. All the stories you read to him as a child were just ones you wrote on the spot. Yes, but I doubt he even remembers that. I don't even know if he can read Dumbo... Tamil uh, literature, much less understand it. I used to wonder why he wanted to turn his back on all the unique and special things his roots have to offer. But after that night in the park, maybe he's thinking it's better not to be unique or stand out in any way. And I don't think we can blame him for that. Damn, Rip Shrek. Get, get shell sniped. No titication. Exactly, dude. No titication. It's reminding you that you have no bitches. <laughs> oh my gosh. Um, I guess it wasn't the best decision to move. I don't get to write here. You don't get to teach here. It's hard for Coven to be who he really wants to be here. Maybe you should have stayed. If you're going to suggest I would have been better off not moving here with you, my anger is going to be anything but fleeting. But come on, I know how much you miss home. Wouldn't you be happier back there? If I felt like I didn't have anyone, then yes, maybe I'd be happier there. <laughs> I'm... I'm <that's laughs> Oh my god. I was gonna time out Ellie, but alright. I'll let him talk. <laughs> but I have Coven, and I have you. Home is where you two are. See, like, as you guys know, probably my family goes to India all the time, so, like, this is something they've been dealing with after my, like, both of their kids went to college. Longing for those who have forsaken you diminishes the beauty of the soul. Yeah, shout out to my ex. Woo, woo, woo. <laughs> anyway <laughs> this is such a pretty game what what do you mean what <laughs> knowing your ex she's probably downstairs vibing with your family fuck off he died I don't think he did he die no way he died I thought it was just a picture. I thought he was just sleeping. She finally smiled after he died. <laughs> oh my gosh. It has a gray picture in his glasses. Oh my god. I didn't notice he's fucking... Come on. Why would they kill him? Oh my god. Are they making the... Yo. I don't know what these are called. But they're so good. Oh my god. I don't want to sound like stereotypes, but G was probably arranged marriage. Come on, man. They were happy together, though. Arranged marriage marriages aren't always the worst, but... Um, oh, bye, Shrek. I didn't even get to read what Shrek said. Rip. <laughs> what am I doing? Ooh, okay. Click that one.
God, there's a lot of shell snipes happening right now. Everyone's getting fucking wiped out in my chat. There's no one allowed to talk. God, what are these called? I never had them made at home. Like, we just buy them from the Indian grocery store. But they're really good. God, I'm trying to remember what they're called. I can't think, though. I guess we'll never know. Oh my god, my mom makes this too. Wait, maybe. She uses this pot to make something. Oops. It even has the red coloring around it, like the red um, paint. That's the same exact like thing that my mom uses. <laughs> this is so cool. I feel like I really just my culture is really being shown here, man. This makes me happy. Oh, they're making. Okay, I think I know what they're making. I don't. I, again, I'm so bad with the words, but um, it would be really funny if they make. I had like an Indian dinner tonight so it'd be really funny if they we got to make what they made or what my mom made tonight at some point i can talk no one can defeat me yeah zen has the power then we're gonna have to flip all these over in a second right or are we not gonna have to they're not gonna make us flip them over they are i knew it This is different from what my mom makes, but I know that it's a thing. Like, I know, I know what they're making. Crunchy little guys. That's what we're going to call them. The little crunch balls. My mom would make them for me for uh, lunch sometimes uh, in school, but... Um, Again, it was it was hard being Indian in in American school, you know. Flipping them with your hands? No, I'm sure she used a little a little thing. I think my mom actually uses her hands though. She just pokes it. Damn, it's all stained red. Blue fish, red flesh, flesh, blue flesh. One flesh, youth, two flesh. Are they kind of sweet on the inside? Uh, no. It's kind of like um. Uh, what would it re what would it be like the most? It's not um galub jamun if that's what you're thinking of. Cause that's also like a little circular ball that's kind of brownish, but it's like. That's like a sweet. I think that what she was making was like not sweet. <laughs> oh, my mom has done these and she got like hit by one of these seeds once because it just popped out of the pot. Is she making chai? I, I don't know how to make chai, so I wouldn't know, but I just feel like, you know, it's a tiny pot with like some seeds and things. I wouldn't be surprised. I really like the music. This is nice. This is so sweet, dude. Can we have more? Oh shit. Can we have more? Uh, it's it's a topping, I guess. Can we have like more Indian games, please? Like, if more Indian developer developer blah, 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 developers make games and uh, they put them on Game Pass or send them to me or someone lets me know that they exist, I will play. I don't even need to be sent it. I'll pay for it. I just I, I want to play. <laughs> I want I want to see more of my culture represented. I like that I can't fuck up anymore. That's nice, you know? Because I'm so used to fucking up so much. <laughs> Doesn't chai mean tea? It is, yes, yes. Uh, you really said develop merp when you're gonna visit Daisy soon? I don't, I would never, I would never say merp, never. I'm such a good child. Yo, Daisy's gonna kill me. <laughs> I'm living with Daisy for like three days. She's gonna murder me. 
There might be some on Itch.io. There's so much indie, indie stuff on there. Maybe. This one came to Game Pass, which is why I heard of it. I'm sure some of this I won't recognize because I don't eat meat. Flip. That wasn't tea? Yeah, it wasn't tea. I was guessing that it might be like chai. Because the chai that my mom makes, it, it, like, I don't know. Tea is different for everyone. But like, whenever my mom makes tea, like, quote unquote tea, whenever she makes chai, she doesn't use like tea packets. It's like masala that she makes, her, like, mixes herself and stuff. I wish it said the ingredients she used. Honestly, I agree. It'd be nice to be able to like know how to do this stuff. Oh damn, she made a whole feast. This is all in one day. Make the dinner spread. Hell yeah, dude. Look at that. This game seems very high quality though. It is. Yeah, because it's on Game Pass. So it's, you know. They put a lot of indie stuff on there, but generally the indie stuff is pretty high quality, I'd say. God, I want to know what... I got to see if I can figure out the name of that swirly thing that we made first. Spiral Indian snack. Yeah, Chakri. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll put it in chat. The name of this is this. It's it's great. I love it. It's like a little snack. I'll cook your favorite mutton. Hi, Amma. Thank you so much. Sure, Amma. I have a lot of plans today, but I think I can stop by for a bit later tonight. So super sorry, Amma. Something came up last minute. I can't make it tonight. Oh, that checks out. She's waiting for her son. Yeah. Not Kevin Shrek. It's Govin. Come on. That's the thing, like, in Indian cultures are super, super family-oriented. Ori um, so, like, the parents, like, you know, they, they raise the kids hoping that, like, for, like, the son is expected to live with the, f the parents. The wife, or, like, the daughter, whenever she gets married, moves in with her husband, but, like, or, like, her husband and her husband's family. But, um... The appearance reminded me of a churro, but it appears to be very different. Yeah, it's not, um, it's not sweet. It's got, like, not spicy, but it's just, like, it's crunchy and, like, yeah. Oh, your pl application's been accepted, finally. Hell yeah. But yeah, like, but when you're, like, an American kid, um, without one's dignity, one becomes a puppet to many strings. Oh. When you're, like, a kid born in in Amer born and raised in America, like it's less family oriented, I'd say, and like you're spending more time with your friends and stuff. That's why she's always sad, I think, is because like she's not used to like, you know. Um, sorry, I'm gonna. I was gonna. I was reading the the thing, but because I was hoping, I was worried it would like go away before I read it. But yeah. Um, she's always sad because when you move to America from India, like, the cultures are so vastly different. Like, it's, it's insane. It's really different. So I don't think she's used to, like, I think that's what they're going for, the creators, is like, you know. Did the mom die? It didn't seem like it. She got a job just now. Um, anyway, yeah, so, um, Coven sent a picture of the, um, Mask that's been hanging in the wall or hanging in the home for a while. He said, "Great, but just so you know, that's not usually hung inside the house." But they totally hung that inside the house in it like earlier in the game. But anyway, anyway, it's very hype, and it's the vibe this kid was going for. My dad just liked to hang it inside. Okay, all right, fair enough. You fixed your little plot hole. Yeah, that's fine. I just need something unique and interesting here. By the way, for the school lunch scene. I was thinking it'd be cool if it was like a super diverse table of kids and they all shared food from different cultures. What do you think Priya's lunch should be? Chicken tikka? Okay. <laughs> Immediately going with chicken tikka is like, um, damn. And, <laughs> and well, Priya is Tamil, so probably none of those. Yeah, that's real. Um, they seem to be giving away her stuff. I don't know. Maybe he just went home. I don't know. 
What if we show her eating nothing? Like, I would bring back my lunch a lot. I was too embarrassed to eat it at school. Who is Chris Kendall? I think, I assume it's like just one of uh, Coven's friends from college. Maybe we can touch upon that. I, it looks like they're working on a little school project. I don't think he's giving away any stuff. I think from what I can tell, he's um, working on a school project and looking through stuff for like his culture. Oh, that might not fit the tone of the show. It's just a fun scene that celebrates different cultures and cuisines that really represent Toronto. You must have a favorite dish your mom made or something, right? It just feels weird for me to write a scene where she isn't even a bit apprehensive about the lunch. I was terrified to even open the lid. Um, I get we're celebrating it, but a scene like this would make me feel like I was worried about nothing when I wasn't. Okay. I want to beat up this Chris guy. I mean, I'm sure he has good intentions, but he's just being kind of just thinking about himself. Yeah, I'll check my mother's recipe book. Damn. Okay, if I have to give them a recipe, the least I can do is ensure it's authentic. I can't believe Amma didn't take the recipe book with her when she left to India, though. Whoa, it looks like she's fixed a lot of these recipes. I can't read Tamil very well, but let's see. Ooh, Idlis. This is Puttu? Oh, I remember making this with Amma and Appa. That was fun. Biryani, of course, Appa's favorite. Natu koj, koji kulambu. That's like chicken soup, I think. <coughs> Sorry. She made this one for me. This for me one time when I was really ill. My guy got them Harry Potter glasses and that dog on a 77 beard. Dude, the um The glasses are so real. That's when I got those glasses, I was also called Harry Potter. And I've been called Harry Potter my whole life. Everyone just was like, yes, you're very Harry Potter. Gonna go eat off Ellie's trash can? Enjoy, Shrek. This is the only thing I could eat without throwing up. I must have been around five then. I still remember the taste, the smell, and the day she made it. There's a phone call from India. The cooker was whistling. Amma fed it to me, but I think she was upset about something. I wonder what it was. Anyway, so if I'm going to feature this recipe in the show, I better cook it once at least. Oh, how helpful. She's drawn cute pictures of the ingredients needed. I'll go pick this up first, and I can start putting it together. <laughs> R.A. Potter? I mean, I wasn't called R.A. back then, but... That's funny! You're a funny guy! Oh, thanks, guys. Thanks, game, for not translating it. Um, okay. So this plus this goes in the water, and then, and then it goes into the thing. I can't really read this, but thankfully there's a diagram. It looks like I have to mix the tamarind with the water to extract its essence multiple times. Okay, so we're going to put this in here, and then put this in here, and then, what am I doing? Oh, okay, there we go. Oh, the water really changed color. I could add more water directly to this bowl, but that might dilute the extracted water. I need to find a way to separate the extracted water and the, okay, well, that's not that, that's not that difficult. There we go. And then we do a little mixy, mixy, mixy do. There we go. Who the hell is calling me right now? <laughs> I left, I left my damn thing on. How dare you, you fucking idiots. <laughs> my, they called a group chat knowing that I was streaming. Oh my God. That's what I get for leaving my, um, for leaving my Discord unmuted. Because I do it sometimes. You know, I should just mute it right now. I do it sometimes whenever I'm in a multiplayer um, stream so that you guys know when I mute. So you know I'm not just talking over people. But um, I forget to turn it back, turn the audio back off when, uh, you know. <laughs> anyway, uh, the water isn't really changing color that much anymore. I think I've gotten everything I can from the tumbler. Let me add to the other bowl and see. Okay. There we go. That's as much as I'm going to get, I think. I hope this means the tumbling water is ready. On to the next thing. 
block them? Yeah, they're all yeah, they're done. I'm done with all of them. <laughs> Dude, I think you're getting a just quick call. Thanks, fish sick. I appreciate it. I think so too. I I I believe I was. <laughs> That's funny. Alright. <laughs> Report them to Discord and get them banned. I cannot read any of this. Okay. Okay, well, there's no diagrams in this one. My thumbnail isn't the most fluent, so I might not be able to translate this fully. But maybe I can do it step by step. I think I make out a few of these words. Toast both of the grains first. Nice. Just have to figure out the missing parts. And we can go step by step. Although I don't really see any grains. Did I mistranslate something? Toast both of the grains first. Um. Oh. <laughs> Bye, crow. <laughs> I forgot that I had, um, oh, that's where I recognize fish from. You, you and Mason. <laughs> I knew I recognized your name from somewhere, but you weren't following me. So I was like, where's, where do I know you from? Uh, toast both of the grains first. We come as a pair. Exactly. Um, oh, look at that fish stick. Thank you for the follow. I appreciate it. Uh, I'm gonna go with the sh with the shallots. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I'm gonna go with uh, what else would be one of a, what would be a grain? What's a grain? <laughs> uh, garlic and <laughs> that's not a grain. Um, the powder and is sh are shallots grains? I don't really know. I don't know. I don't know what a grain is. This Q is coming, a grain. I'm gonna come in your grain. <laughs> no, it's not. Oh no. Oh boy. Shallots are not grains, they're like onions. Okay. Well, water isn't grain. Chilies are not grains. Mustard seeds, maybe? Rasam powder? Are there two words that are like, what would, what's a grain? <laughs> are salt a grain? <laughs> grain is like wheat and stuff, rice and all them craps. Okay. So maybe you and you? It's seeds, not grains. Okay. I can't count the number of times I've woken up to the sound though. How's it already smelling so good? Oh, I can read this part easily. Uh, next, add red leaves and chili green chilies. Uh, that's not what I meant to do. Boom. Wait. That's not... I must have my words for red and green switch around. I was about to say. That's not how that works, but it worked out. On to the next step. Add minced something and crushed ginger garlic. Okay. Well, the garlic and ginger is here. Minced... What would we mince? Normally, you mince shallots, I think. Yeah. This smells so good. It's usually around this time... Alma has me uh, waving away all the steam from the smoke detector. That's so real! Yeah, that's they weren't lying about the grains. It's that he can't read thumbnail that well, so he's trying to translate, but he mixed up grains and seeds. Hmm, what gives out water? First add blank that creates water, then add water itself. Something that creates water. Oh, tomatoes. We learned this earlier. Oh, tomatoes. Frying it seems to release a lot of water. Yeah, and then the water itself. So that's what the thumbnail water is for. I think he was lying on purpose. Yeah, probably. I think he's trying to gaslight us. Uh, no idea what this says, but only two ingredients left. Add the rustum powder and the salt. The smell is really taking me back. I'm always upset because of the phone call she got from home. Amma is so sweet. I think I remember now. I don't. I actually don't call my parents Amma. I say Mama and Daddy. Gaslight Gatekeep Girl Boss. Yeah. That's him. That's Coven. Gaslight Gatekeep Girl Bossing us away from knowing what a grain is he does. <laughs> I'm sorry, Appa. I'm sorry I'm not there. I know. I thought she was getting better. It's almost the end of the month, so I should be able to see you, send you more money soon. No, no, it's okay. Let me at least be of use this way. Grain boss, of course. Can't read this part either, but there's not much to this. Just put everything in and cook it, I guess. All right, we're gonna put a blop. Okay, fine. You said everything, so I, I was going with everything, prick. Bop, boop. 
in the bot. And then we put you on, and then we put you on. And then we go slop. Oh god, that sound. As you said once, girl queen pussy boss! Girl queen pussy boss, let's go! <laughs> I never liked this sound. Do other cultures use pots that- I'm sure they do, right? That's just normal steam, right? <laughs> that, maybe that's a stupid question. I hate that steam sound, though. I always hated it. Whenever my mom's, like, cooking something with a pot that is gonna, like, release steam and make that really loud noise, I will be upstairs in my room. And often, like, she will be about to- It's been a while, actually, since she's, um, made anything like that. Uh, <laughs> does other food make steam in a pot? The world may never know. <laughs> But every time she did, it's been a while since she has, but when she did, I would, um, I'd be sitting down in the kitchen or we were hanging out, and then I'd just, like, <laughs> I'd, like, give her a look, because you'd hear, like, the little sizzling sound as it's about to release, and then I'd just make a run for it upstairs, <laughs> because I hated that sound. It made me, like, it just messed with my senses a lot. I should keep going. Okay. Keep going. Whoa, that looks fantastic. Chicken stock always has a golden color, but the turmeric is making it look extra nice. Oh man, should we even feature this in the show? Some corporation is going to start selling an over overpriced turmeric chicken stock after watching this. He's so right. Um, she needs to go to India or Spain or Mexico or something. We use pots for Korean food. Once I had a friend over when we used pot and we pretended we were making a strange potion. Because of all the steam, that's so funny. Uh, okay, last step. We just have to mix these together, I suppose. Rest some is usually water, but here it's fresh chicken stock instead. That's really cool. Wow. I wonder how Chris will describe this to the team. An exotic take on a chicken soup made from a variety of spices and aromatics. Gross. <laughs> Real. Oh, well, we should probably mix it in here, right? There we go. Ah, oh, that looks great, Emma. A lot easier than I thought. Let's see if it tastes anything like that day. He burns his mouth and dies. Achievement! Taking stock. Uh, for some reason that reminded me of this video once. I saw once of a Korean family trying traditional Irish food. It was really cute. Yeah, dude. Everyone should try different cultures' foods. It's great. We actually went to a Vietnamese restaurant recently. Food was amazing. It was like pho and stuff. Yeah. My Gieta, that's a raven flashback. Amma, Amma, why are you sad? It's nothing. Her mom's not doing too well. Yo, mama is dead. Sorry. Disrespectful, I'm sorry. Did I do something wrong? Hmm? Oh, no, Kana, not at all. I just, I heard from home, your grandmother. Amma loves her a lot, but sometimes people have to leave and go far away, and Amma will just miss her. Why is she leaving? Cancer. It's natural, Coven. Everyone leaves someday. Us too? It'll happen to everyone. I won't leave you, Amma. Or Appa. Aww. Any recipe updates? Vietnamese is so good. Yeah, we haven't gone to like my parents and I just haven't gone to a restaurant once before. There was so much food. We got like uh, like the noodle soup. Um, oh, he's about to call his mom. Oh, he still has his dad in his contacts, even though he's dead. That's so that's so sad. A humble porridge can taste sweeter than nectar when it's fed by the little hands of one's child. Scrum diddly umptious. There, yeah, so they give us like this big bowl with the noodles at the bottom and then the soup and stuff on top. And the noodles just kept going. Like you could go forever. It was endless noodles. I don't know how they managed it, but I couldn't finish it. I wasn't even close to finishing it. One of my friends did finish it and I was so surprised. What am I doing? Yeah, I told you I'm terrible at this. It's easy, Coven. Listen. It's all about temperature control with dosa. 
Oh, oh we're finally learning how to make dosa. I wanted to, I wanted to learn. Feed our noodles. It's all they eat, dude. I'm I want noodles right now, actually. First pour water, the next set the fire to the lowest setting. Pour the batter, and since the stone isn't hot, you can spread the batter easily. Add oil around the edges and turn up the heat. This will fry the batter and make it easier to flip once the edges are brown. Then it's done. Easy, right? Yeah, for you, another disaster coming up. Alright. Water. Now turn it down. Um, batter. Rotate. Can we please? There we go. I've seen my mom do this before. She does it differently, but I've seen her do it. Yeah, look at that. Perfect dosa. Look at that, dude. I love dosa so much. And we put the oil around the edges. And then when it's ready to flip, we flip it. Oh. Ah, oh, I thought I did everything right. Well, almost. Um, What did I do wrong? Let's ask. You got the first part right, but before you flip, it's crucial to add oil and turn the stove up to high. That's what I did wrong. Okay. Let's try this again. So it's on high. We put water. Then we turn it down to low. Put the dosa. Batter. His dad's glasses. He's wearing his glasses. Really? I didn't notice that. You guys know so much more than me because I'm reading chat while also just like playing the game. So I miss some stuff like that. That's sweet though. Korean noodles are pretty good too, but personally I like pho better. Yeah, dude. Or pho. I don't know how you pronounce it. I think it's pho. Alright, you put oil. And I gotta turn up the heat. And then I can get it give it a bit of a flip. Look at that! Oh my god. I want dosa right now, bro. Now what? Should I turn it down? It's kind of the only button I can press. Oh, there we go. Oh my god. I did it. Good job. Ready to try something harder? Look at that, dude. Are you ready to try utapam? Oh, utapam I've had. The dosa will be a bit thicker this time so we can lay all the vegetables. Oh, this is like the pizza one, right? With all the toppings. Yes. <laughs> yeah, not really though. <laughs> Ari, do you ever cock? I've never. I've never, unfortunately. I have forge um Anyway, <laughs> um, I think Ari's saying it right because my Vietnamese friend would say, guys, I have a Vietnamese friend. Guys, <laughs> sorry. <laughs> That's so unnecessary. All right. I haven't had Uttapam much. There's like certain foods that I guess when I was a kid, I never liked it. So then my mom just assumes that I'll never like it ever again. So whenever she makes it for my dad, she's just like, what do you want? Like, what, what else would you like to have separately from us and I'm like okay I guess I'll have noodles or whatever oh wait now the toppings do I have to add all of them actually you can just add whatever you like everyone's with the mum is different just make sure to add ghee first okay all right well we're gonna add ghee right and then uh, I, I like a bit of uh, a bit of onions and um, carrots yeah yeah I'll go with carrots I'll go with idli powder, of course. Now, I'm not the biggest fan of green chilies, but I'll give it a try, you know? Just just for the sake of it. And then I gotta turn up the heat again, right? And then we're gonna use a little dosa flipper. There we go. Look at it. And then we get it out of here. I think I'm getting the hang of this. Freak frack tic tac, I was drawing on the wrong layer. Oh no! That's such a mood, though. See, I told you it's easy. I haven't made this in a while. This was your upper's favorite. Curry dosa is dosa with minced meat? Yes, exactly. We're doing it with mutton here, but you can do it with chicken, beef, or whatever you like. All right. Let's do this again, baby. Zen, you were real bad about that. <laughs> you always forget. I wish I knew how to make Indian food. Every time I've asked my mom, like, teach me how to make Indian food, she's like, no, you won't get it. It's too hard right now. I'm just like, all right, well, then I'll never learn. And then when I move out, I just won't be able to cook Indian food. Good job, Coven. Now we can start adding the curry toppings. Like, Uttapam, you want to add the ghee first. 
Then add the beaten egg as a coating, followed by the actual curry, and then finish it with coriander. Learn on YouTube, you don't need a mom. Trust me. <laughs> guys, guys, it's funny because he doesn't, because his, because, never mind, you won't get him. You, you won't understand. There we go. And then turn this back up. And then bop. There is a there is a YouTube channel called Dad How Do I, which is all about like things your dad should have taught you. Like it was by it's by a guy who doesn't have who didn't have a dad, so he made a channel to like teach kids who also didn't have a good father figure growing up. Maybe they should make that for mom. I mean at the end of the day, none none of it matters. Like he teaches you how to cook and stuff. It's not like any uh gender standards or some shit like that. But it could be cool if you want like a mother figure. I don't know. Another one down. This is fun. If any of you don't have moms uh, and are willing to be a mother figure, figure to some um, kids, you should try. <laughs> I wonder if I could use that to learn how to shave. I think he actually did do one. Shaving one. When I learned how to shave, it was because of uh, Parathesia and Ellie. <laughs> Ellie and one of his admins. This is fun. Yes, it really is. Good luck starting tea. That sounds awesome. I hope it happens soon. I don't know what you, where you are along your journey. You're doing great, Coven. You can start your own dosa restaurant when you go back. I know, right? I could probably run the best one. If there, if there were restaurants that can serve dosas like this back there, you wouldn't have missed home so much and left, huh? I came here for more than just dosas, Coven. Oh, yeah, of course. I was just joking. Oh. Okay, well, you start eating these. I'll make the rest and then join you. Oh, no, no, I'll do it. Otherwise, they'll get cold before you can eat them. Well, won't they get cold for you then? Let me do it this one time at least. Sure, Coven. That's a real conversation I've had too. My mom's always like, no, no, I'll do it. And I'm like, yeah, but then you have to eat cold food. I don't think you understand. Amma, I have something to show you. This is Amma's recipe book. Have you been using it? Wait, I didn't fix some of these. You fixed those too? And you wrote in Tamo. This is great, Coven. Is this all research for that show you're writing? No, Oma. Actually, I quit that job. Oh, why? I... Uh, it'll probably happen after I move out. Parents don't like the whole trans part. I get that. Yeah, I'm sorry. That sucks. Um, I felt like a fraud. I took the job because it was the first place that would hire me. I suppose the showrunners felt I could offer a Tamil perspective, but I've distanced myself from all of that my entire life. I couldn't even speak the language fluently. See, this is why our friend Para helped Ari learn how to shave. Yeah, dude. Um. Oh yeah, Ellie also helps me out with Twitch and OBS and all the other stuff, and with um, what do you call it? Uh, with Mix It Up. <laughs> he sent me like all of my commands. Um. This is like, this is totally, I relate to this very hard. I like, I, I want to be part of my culture, but I, I distanced myself from it since I was kind of young. So now it's like scrambling to get back into it and learn. Um, what perspective can I even offer? I've acted like being Tamil was inconvenient for me my whole life, but now I'm acting Tamil when it is convenient for me, when there's a job on the line. I couldn't deal with it. I had no idea you felt this way. So you know I was drawing the layer, I was so annoyed that I was drawing the layer that I didn't actually end up switching layers, so I did it twice. <laughs> Zen, you're a stupid idiot sometimes. That's so mean. Oh my gosh. It's true, I'm, uh, I'm just a tourist. And I wasn't there for you after Appa. And every time I wanted to apologize, I just felt too guilty to even face you. You've always said you stayed in Canada for me. I know how much it must have hurt you to come back here. How much I must have hurt you. And Appa. It was so sudden. I always thought there would be time to tell him how much he inspires me. Even the stories he made up when I was a child and read them to me until I finally slept. My writing can't hold a candle to those. If I'm writing today, it's because of him. I'm still just trying to catch up to him. That's not why I came here, Coven. You didn't? 
I came here because that's what's best for me, and even though it hurt me, it's what's best for you. What do you mean? I loved living here. The people, my parents, my job, everything. Leaving India was necessary, but really hard. I felt bad for leaving, and I missed it so much that I wanted to raise you like we never left here. It must have been suffocating for you. And after Pav Pavalan, I still can't pronounce that name correctly. I keep second guessing myself. It's so much easier when I don't think about it, because if I know the word, I just go with it. Well, coming back here and teaching all these kids has been great. If I'd stayed there, I don't think I could have given you the space you needed. Thanks, Amma. How long are you staying for? I don't know, Amma. <laughs> I don't know, I was quoting a meme. I'm not therapy, Zen, get help. <laughs> oh my gosh. But this is really nice. Oh. I'm gonna try not to cry on stream. I'm gonna just smile through the pain. <laughs> this is such a sweet story. Designed and written by Ubby. Just Ubby. Alright. Well, thank you guys for watching that. Uh we're gonna keep uh going. But uh, after the credits and stuff end, and if there's nothing left, then I'm going to end the VOD, and we're going to start a new VOD for the next game. I'm missing some achievements. I'll probably just go back and do these. Complete every recipe without messing up one, so I'll have to, yeah. I'll probably do these on my own. There's some secret achievements. I don't even know how to get them. Um, first person to cry is weak lemo. <laughs> I'm more the most likely to, you know, cry because I relate. <laughs> Uh, two hours less, let's go. Oh, two hours, let's go. Wait, no, one more minute. Um, well, the VOD is a mi uh, an hour, 50 minutes, unfortunately. We started late, but, you know, we don't need to mention that to them. Don't tell, don't tell the VOD. Don't tell them. Don't let them know, please. Thanks. Thanks. Okay, I'm gonna move on from this. Because I kind of haven't been focusing on the captions anyway. Uh, is there a new game plus? <laughs> Imagine that'd be funny Boohoo cry cry I relate to my Indian family being rich and never ever needing anything in life because I learned everything I want boohoo That's you by the way Ari. Okay, Ellie. All right, bud. Calm down <laughs> What a little prick. All right. Well, oh, we're not even on Xbox for the next stream uh, or for the next part of the stream But VOD, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this game uh, I would recommend playing it on your own if you want checking it out listening to music on your own without all the jokes and the hijinks um, so yeah, go give it a shot if you want and learn about Indian cultures just cause, you know, try Indian food, learn how to make some, I don't know, just do it just for the sake of it, you know, do it for other cultures too. It's fun. It's great. It's nice to, for all of us to kind of, you know, merge, you know, anyway, uh, goodbye Vod. Thank you for watching. Bye YouTube. Welcome back YouTube. Goodbye YouTube. Bye.